Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. I'm really excited today to bring you a product range which I've been exploring with for about the last two weeks. It is by John Frieda and it is the Pro Filler for Fine Hair. We're going to be talking shampoo, conditioner and, which I always love, a thickening spray to complete everything. So you've got that whole system, starts in the bathroom when your hair is wet. So if you've got fine textured hair, flat hair, or perhaps you really like to style your hair, you like to try all different styles, but because of your hair texture and your hair type and your dental, Density, it just falls flat, usually about an hour or so afterwards, or you struggle to hold that style altogether. I'm talking to women, I'm talking to men. If you've got fine hair, this system is really, really cool, and it's certainly something you're going to be wanting to try out. Okay, so what's my hair type texture? Okay, so I've got fine hair, I've got a lot of it. Last May, up until around about three months ago, I was losing a lot of hair, and I would have never have showed you with this, but this part in here. You can still see a little bit of it here and up and underneath here slightly but as you can see my hairline is much thicker and all the little hairs growing back through are coming through and i've got i've got nice amount of uh regrowth in here and things again were really good that i will put down to hair gain okay uh supplements that is with con trying to control stress um eating the right things while i'm stressed while i'm not well i don't particularly eat enough OK, um, and that's just trying to revamp my whole lifestyle and really concentrate on me turning things around the hair supplement. Um, I've had ill health and things in the background. Um, I lost my nan, who was my world. Um, and of course, those things don't go away, but it's trying to all it's to put them in almost like a healthy pattern to process. So I've been really trying to concentrate on that and using all the right products. So using things which is for thin hair, for getting thicker hair. And you know, my hair is really, really changing. And today, the last two weeks, I've seen, about, I'd say about three weeks ago, I've seen this. Okay. It was about the same time as mum was going in for major surgery because she was looking for things, getting ready to go into her uh, into hospital for operation. I'm pleased to report that's going well. She had to have a lot of uh, surgery, which we didn't think she would have had to have had on top of what she was having done. But I'm pleased to report that she's doing incredibly well. Um, so I love her lots and God bless her. And she's doing incredibly well. As I said, her recovery is going five star. Um, so great. So I actually, I bought this in a way to be able to try, um, for when we were, were through all of that, um, my mum's got fine hair, but she's got lots and lots of it. Um, and she often finds that it doesn't necessarily hold a style. Exactly the same as my hair. Okay. Um, I find that I've got a lot less than what my, my mum's got a lot more than me. Um, but my hair, often whenever I go to style it, I like to have it like this. I had it a lot longer, um, but I had it cut just because of how much I lost. Um, and I wanted to try, I want, I love to try different products for fine hair, thin hair, um, and really creating the most, I love to rock kind of really cool, snazzy sort of character hair, I always call it. So I really wanted to try this. Let's start with the shampoo. Always a great place. So you may think, okay, I've got fine hair, I've got thin hair, thinning hair, can't really do anything about it. Let me tell you, my friend, that if you've got the finest, thinnest hair, which you think you've never ever seen, with the right products, the right know-how and the tips, your hair can look absolutely amazing. If you're a lady, it can look glamorous. It can look really, really beautiful. If you're a guy, it can look really, really cool, really, really on point and really, really sharp. But it's knowing what to do the right way and the right products and things. So it starts in the bathroom when your hair's wet. Okay. Using the right shampoo. If you've got fine textured hair, stay away from anything hydrating. Stay away from anything which says smoothing. These are for frizzy, thicker hair textures, not like ours. This is really, really great. So the shampoo, it's got a really, really nice smell. It's got a real nice lather. You don't need to use loads of it. Here, let's talk about it. So John Fried, I always loved John Frieda products, I have to admit. I loved a men's range, which they had a couple of years back, but they discontinued it. It says new results in one use, which it absolutely, I can completely agree with that. It really, really does. So it's, sorry, by the way, I'm on a creaky stool. Uh, I don't know why that is. It's never really creaked or anything before, but it's, it's creaking right now. So apologies for that if you can hear anything. It's not anything embarrassing. It's, <laughs> it's, it's just the stool. So, okay. So pro filler for fine hair. Um, so thickening shampoo plumps overall thickness by 200% and cleanses hair. It's with biotin and hyaluronic acid, silicon three. So there's nothing in this hair, which is going to give it an unnatural feel. Um, in this product rather, and it's not going to be coating our hair with cakey products and just making it feel really, really fake. It's got biotin, so we know if you, well, I know, you don't necessarily know, but biotin is often in products which is designed for fine or thinning hair because it, 
it really plumps, it gives the hair character, it gives the hair life, and it almost, if you can kind of imagine, it's like a sponge, it sort of plumps things up to make it a little bit more thicker and fuller. So hyaluronic acid as well, we're probably used to seeing that in skincare. A lot of men's and women's skincare, anti-aging, sort of energizing, those type of products, hyaluronic acid is put in there to number one, fight aging, possibly, um, to energize the skin, to plump the skin, to put moisture into the skin, and just revitalize and make it feel and look as healthy and as comfortable as possible. Hyaluronic acid in hair care does similarly, uh, the similar thing, to be honest. Plumps hair with moisture, plumps it with character, gives hair life. If you've got long, lifeless hair, perhaps, if you've got fine textured hair, which sits very, very heavy on the top, hyaluronic acid is going to be really great in this shampoo and conditioner system because it's going to give you life. It's going to give you body. And this is exactly what this does. Let me tell you a little bit about it. So instantly get the look and feel of more hair. Infuse of biotin and hyaluronic acid, this shampoo visibly plumps, leaving you with thicker, fuller, and stronger hair in one use. So hyaluronic acid is also going to repair those weak fragments in the hair as well and it's going to look after and give your hair a real natural feel and a real nice fullness and shine and it does that absolutely from the first use i completely agree with that okay so clinical tests plumps overall hair thickness by 200 percent stronger hair with less breakage so the less breakage i can completely agree with because it really does make your hair feel amazing and full and often if you use a product for volume or for fine hair then you will you will find that the hair almost feels a little bit like uh, you've got like a, a hairspray product in it. This doesn't. It feels really touchably soft. It feels really, really natural. And it feels just naturally like you you have got more hair. Now, yes, I have got a product um, over my hair. It's just a light hold hairspray. And to be honest, um, just with my fingers, I can sort of pull through it and it's absolutely fine. Um, I really, really like this. It really is a very nice system to use. Plumps are all hair thickness by 200%. I'm not sure. I don't like that statistic, I'll be quite honest with you. 200% seems so on the point, because um, that's almost like I've got 100% of my hair. That's almost like my hair again, and then again, in my mind. Um, and that, it doesn't do. I'll be honest with you, it doesn't do that. It does give you thicker feeling hair. It does make you look as though you've got more hair. I just simply uh, blow dried my hair this morning with my rectangular brush. Nothing sort of professional or out of this world. What I always do is whichever way my hair falls, so say it falls off to the right, I blow my hair dry off, um, I blow dry my hair off to the left, so the opposite direction. So always dry your hair to the opposite direction your hair falls. It just gives your hair much more body and much more fullness because you're going against how your hair naturally falls, which is what I would always recommend. And then flip your head forward and blow dry your hair because that gives your hair and your roots on top of your head much more volume and fullness. Now, you may see this around here, but I can assure you this is not bad. This is, an, this is so much better. And I can actually feel confident in my hair because I've got the regrowth. My hair is much more thicker and fuller. Go back many months. I had a real opening of a triangle here and I didn't have any of this hair here and these fine hairs actually now are swept back and they're included in this hair here so and i've got a bright line in front of me as well so it doesn't even look that much um, of what you can actually necessarily see particularly this area here so let's move forward so shampoo really really amazing absolutely love it and if you're a guy and sometimes you just use shampoo then this would be amazing because it's really it's not drying it just literally works on making your hair all around amazing Let's move on. So conditioner, this is where it gets even more crazy. Um, so pro filler for fine hair, thickening conditioner. That was, of course, the thickening shampoo. Plumps overall thickness by 200%. Biotin, hyaluronic acid. We've already covered that. Get the look and feel of more hair. Don't need to read any more. Is it any good? This stuff, it's really creamy, but it's light. How often do you ever use a product and it says for volume, but yet it just weighs your hair down so much. It just looks like that it's put that much moisture into your hair that actually you don't even look as though you've got any hair. It looks like it's just paper. I've done that a lot. I've got fine textured hair, rather a lot of it, not as much on this side, but it's growing back. It's getting much, much thicker. And this stuff gives amazing, amazing volume. My mum used this before she had um, her surgery and the effect it gave in her hair, because she has fine hair, it seems to take on a uh, body with using the right tools and tricks much more easier. Um, but mum's got a lot of it and it was just so glamorous. The mirror shines. She's got very, very long hair. Absolutely beautiful incredible she's very glamorous anyway but this really really special product so if you are sat here thinking i've got quite fine hair but i've got a lot of it my style doesn't really hold if i blow dry my hair it doesn't really hold if i curl my hair it doesn't really hold this is going to be amazing that's exactly what my mum's like but amazing she always wears her hair up she doesn't usually like it down but when she does this stuff 
He used it just once, and it was absolutely incredible. I'm a guy, clearly, <laughs> and I've used this, and I absolutely love it. So if you're a guy sat there watching this, it's going to be really, really cool for you. If you've got fine hair, you like a lot of volume in the top of your hair, you like it all short and spiky, but you like a lot of height. My twin brother does the same. He's used this once. to use anything in the bathroom. I used to be like that until I started concentrating on fine hair products. Um, and yeah, a world of difference. It's really great on him. It's really great on me. Really great on my mum. And I absolutely recommend it for you. The conditioner, yes, it looks after things. Yes, it gives you that moisture. It repairs that little bit of sort of wear and tear, which we all get day to day just through styling our hair and just through daily daily life, to be quite honest with you. When you style your hair, perhaps you run your fingers through your hair, perhaps it's a little bit dry in different areas. Perhaps you've got bleached hair. Perhaps you've got processed hair. Or perhaps you've just been doing too much of it for far too long. This stuff is going to allow you to have volume in your hair, pro filler, the hyaluronic acid is going to fill those weak areas, the biotin is going to plump your hair up, it's going to really, really transform things for you. This stuff I love. Conditioner, done. Amazing system shampoo conditioner. And then to spoil it even more, which I absolutely love this, is the pro filler for fine hair spray. So this is thickening spray, again, by 200%, not quite sure on that. Um, if you were there blow drying your hair all day, probably, because you can build and build volume with this, I do find. Um, it's got biotin and hyaluronic acid in here, results in one use, really nice applicator, just a spray bottle. And literally, I wouldn't normally say this, because you don't need loads, but I absolutely soak my hair with this. Okay, I soak my hair with this. Let me tell you a bit about it on back here. So instantly get the look and feel of more hair, infused with biotin hyaluronic acid. This spray visibly plumps hair whilst protecting it from heat. It makes hair thicker, fuller, and ready to use. Okay, spray throughout tile dried hair, making sure to fully cover under sections and root area. Spray to distribute evenly from root to tip for maximum fullness. Style hair using a blow dryer until completely dry. And that's what I do. And your hair just almost, and this is going to sound such a cliche, but it almost just kind of inflates and it gives you that lovely sort of swish to your hair. And I always say, if you've got a natural swish to your hair, it looks healthy, it looks full, it looks amazing and it just gives you so much more confidence and this stuff is truly truly great so this doesn't this is not like a hairspray product it doesn't make your hair stiff it doesn't make your hair feel cakey or anything like that at all it is really very nice i sprayed it all throughout the top of my hair and as you can see it's gone a bit ott but i really really like it um the opposite side when my hair was a lot longer i used to sort of pull it all off to one side and literally pass the straightener through the ends, keep the volume in the roots, and just do it a bit crazy. And yeah, I like it. it. Looks really, really cool. And I like, I like the style. I like products to be able to make my life easier when styling the hair, which I love and enjoy. Okay, so something else I want to cover as well. So I am always looking for something which is going to help my hair grow. So yes, I'm taking the supplement in the background. Yes, I've tried really expensive top-end sprays by Neoxin, by L'Oreal Cerioxal. They're my favourites. But of course... Things are getting expensive in this day and age, and you haven't always got the money to use it. So these are £9 each, by the way. So 9 for the shampoo, 9 for the conditioner, and lo and behold, 9 for the spray as well. They're an amazing system, one of my favourites, to be quite honest with you. But I like to know that there's products in here which is good for my hair. So one of the things I always like to see in a product for fine hair is caffeine. So caffeine, in my heart, in my mind, is prevention is better than cure. So if you've lost all of your hair, then I'll be completely honest with you, caffeine is not going to be something barking at completely the wrong tree. But caffeine will help stimulate and keep the energy in your follicles. So prevention is far better than cure. So if you've got fine hair, but you haven't really lost any, but you struggle to hold a style, you want to keep your hair, you want to keep it as full as possible, then something with caffeine in is going to really give you what you're looking for, to be honest in my mind. Stimulating, keeps things healthy and clear at the scalp level, and gives you that energy which you need in your follicles to keep growing that amazing hair. Shampoo. Love that when I look down through in here, okay, let's find it, I can see caffeine, hyaluronic acid, okay, biotin. Three things I love to see in a shampoo. The caffeine stimulates and gives me energy in my roots. The hyaluronic acid looks after the lengths and my scalp, okay, the biotin plumps everything up, Really, really cool. Is it in the conditioner? Okay. Caffeine, hyaluronic acid, biotin. Not many systems do you have it in the conditioner. Yeah, you usually find it in the shampoo. You don't usually find it in the conditioner. I absolutely love that. So yeah, I'm shampooing my hair. I've got the products in which is looking after my scalp, my actual follicles, keeping them energized and awake, and biotin to plump everything up and make it looking really, really cool. Doing it in the shampoo. 
doing it in the conditioner. Leave it on for a couple of minutes. It's amazing. Then I think, is it in the spray? Let me share that with you. Okay, so in this spray, it's got hydrolyzed rice protein. So you do tend to find products like that to give the hair plumpness, fullness, with that heat activating ingredient. So it really plumps things up immediately. So that's great. Okay, then if I look down here, it's got caffeine in. Great. So I like that. I like that it's got the biotin and, of course, the hyaluronic acid in as well. So all throughout the whole system, you've got that invigoration of the roots. You've got that looking after the lengths and ends of the hair. You've got that plumpness from the biotin as well. It's an all-round win-win. I absolutely love this system. And by John Frieda, please don't discontinue it because this stuff is one of my best systems I absolutely love. Let's talk about that. What do I recommend for hair for and hair loss? My experience, I absolutely love. Straight off the top of my head, he says, um, this system, okay, so John Frieda, pro filler for fine hair. Love that. Shampoo, conditioner, root spray. I love the Aveeno Greens uh, volumizing shampoo and conditioner because that's got the rosemary extract in there, which is really great as well. I like the Cerioxyl by L'Oreal Professional shampoo, conditioner, and denser hair uh serum. I like the light thinning and progress thinning by Neoxin, okay, shampoo conditioner, and their daytime sandal or hair loss spray, and their nighttime oxidine uh, pipette uh, um, sort of drop treatment as well. I absolutely love that too. Um, I like the, I think it's Simon Fritz, Fritz, Simon Fritz something, I can't quite remember now, in the, in the red bottles, it's on my channel, really, really love that, it's got caffeine as well, Simon Fritz something, I think it is, I can't quite remember now, um, but it's on my channel anyway, please do have a look, um, and that's got caffeine in too, I really, really love that, um, and I think, oh, and I love uh, Philip Kingsley, volumizing shampoo conditioner, absolutely love that as well, and I love... There's a real natural one, which I actually discovered on, on a holiday last year. And my mum bought it back for me as well from Cyprus, where my parents go very, very often. Um, oh, wow. And that's that's a French brand. I can't quite remember what that is, but it's on my channel as well. If you do want to ask me any questions about any of these products, please leave me a question down below and I will get back to you as quickly as I can. Why can't I think of those? It doesn't matter anyway. We're talking about John Frieda, but there's a collection of different products which I like to use uh, for my hair, which has been thinning. It's getting thicker. Um, I have got fine hair, a lot of it, but you know what? Hair is one of those things. You think you're fine one minute, then the next a problem can start. So prevention is always better than cure. And it's always great to know what works for you and what doesn't. OK, so thank you very much indeed for being here for this clip. Thank you very much for being here. And I wish you well. God bless. Take great care. And I will be seeing you soon. Bye now.